Hi, it's Allie from APS EdTech. Let's clean up our Google Drive for the summer. I'll show you how to put these quick steps into action. First, find your classroom folder. If you are using Google Classroom, Google Drive has already created a place where all of your materials are stored. You want to know which folder that is because you do not want to delete it. So I recommend renaming this if you haven't already to something like do not delete. That way you do not touch anything that is in that folder. Next, let's organize all of this year's teaching materials. Come up here to new folder, name it this year, click create. Now you have a brand new folder. We're going to add anything from our root drive, from the unorganized part of our my drive into that folder to organize all of our things from this year. You can simply click anywhere on the white, highlight and select multiple files. You can then use this icon up here, move to, select the new folder that you just created and click move. You can also use list view for your drive. Scroll down to those uh, unorganized things that you want to put into your folder from this year. Click, drag, highlight multiple files at a time. You can click your move icon or over here, click this down arrow to expand all of your files. And instead of using this move to icon, I can simply drag those items into that teaching materials folder. Continue this process until you are organized. Feel free to also start deleting anything that you do not need anymore. If you delete anything from your shared with me section, it will not delete the actual file. Simply, it will delete the shortcut that has been shared with you. And anyone else who is a collaborator or owner will still have access to the document. Have fun getting everything ready for the summer so that you can start the new year fresh.